Hello everyone and welcome back to Chronos Play Xenoblade Chronicles. Last time, we got to the point of no return in uh, the prison island. This time, we're going to be doing some side quests. Uh, how I plan on handling this is going to a main hub, picking up pretty much all the quests, for the most part on camera. Um, I'm going to record the dialogue and stuff like that. And then, I'll go through the quests and see like how many are kill quests, how many are collect quests, and see how I can handle that. I also want to say that I actually went around Colony 6 and I uh, traded with some people and even got uh, Palma actually had spike defense gems, which would have came in handy earlier, Palma, but this lovely lady here. Hi there. Hi there. Uh, she has an other. If it loads, there we go. She has an other collectible coin of fortune. And we will. Give her one of these, I guess. Alright. So let's use that. I think that's our second other one. Uh, that's another thing I'm going to be doing is when we go to these hubs and I'm going to be trading with everyone. <laughs> Trying to find these other ones, other uh, collectibles, because apparently people have them. Um... Also, in between episodes, I went back to Prison Island and actually call in nine to get the uh, rabbit diodes. And I got two bolt elements, so let's upgrade our special. I sold some materials that we're not using either, but that's a pretty big house with turrets on top of it. It's a fortress. It's like that, uh, it's a fortress from Call in the Nine. The HQ of Stronghold has been completed. You now get collectibles there. Reconstruction 6, Population 3. Category Complete Bonus Special. You received a present from all the residents. Master Glasses. I think that's our second pair. Alright, I don't think we can update anything else. Oh, we're done with Special. We're done with Special. Woo! Alright, so we need some Caterpillar Silk. Daylight Spurs. Then we need Ancient Sardi Meat. I went back and I traded with that kid. And Hill Flyer Firefly. Are those the things outside Colony 6? I'll look into it. I'll kill them like on the way to Colony 9. Oh, I'm just going to teleport to Colony 9. Anyways, yeah, so I'm going to go over to uh, Colony 9. And I'll be right back. Alright, so I was exploring and I noticed that we could view... Well, Ryan and Fiora have the affinity to do this heart to heart. So let's try it. Nice! What are you cooking, Fiora? It's a secret. Don't be nosy. If I tell you, it'll spoil the surprise. Yeah, but... I just wanted to know so my belly would shut up for a minute. Oh, did you want some too? I don't know if I made enough. Of course I want some, sounds like something Ryan would say. Your food is the best. That's not exactly what I thought you'd say, but more of, I could eat anything. If you're cooking, there's no way I'd turn it down. You know, the only ones who ever say that are you and Dunban. That's Shulk, no manners. Whatever I give him, he says it's tasty. But I honestly don't think he can tell either way. It's like he has no sense of taste at all. Yeah, I do wonder about him sometimes. That's just how he is. I wouldn't think too hard about it. He eats it, so he must like it. Uh, maybe. You keep on cooking for him. I think he more likes Fiora. Don't you worry, I'm going to. So, uh, can we eat? Yeah, you might as well. That kind of seems rude. This seems more like a Ryan thing, so, uh, can we eat? Haha! <laughs> and there's me thinking you cared about something other than food. Oh, uh... Did you say something? Was it about food? Hey, don't mind if I do. Oh, nom 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 nom. Hands off, Ryan. I haven't finished cooking it yet. But I'm so hungry. You wouldn't leave a grown man starving now, would you? I will if you don't keep your grubby paws away until it's ready. Right. That's it. You've had enough already, Ryan. You're not getting any more today. What? What? But Fiora, I told you I'm starving here. Sigh. I guess I can't stop you being you. Okay, you can have some more, but only a little. Yes! You're the best, Fiora. Shulk's a lucky man. That's enough out of you, mister. 
Go and tell Shulk dinner's ready. That's adorable. All right, I'll see you guys in a second. Hi there. Hi there. Hey, all right. Uh, Minute Mantis. Uh, yeah, blue glow sounds good enough. Let's do it again sometime. Yeah. All right. Mysterious Mantis. Who was that? Sonia? Yeah, I think that was Sonia. We're making good progress on these. We're, we're like 42% of the way done. I almost said 50% of the way done, but then again, I'm not bright sometimes. All right, so we're gonna try with this guy first. Then we'll talk to him. I'm not sure if it's just one other thing per area or if one area can have multiple. What am I supposed to do? His birthday is just around the corner, but I've got work. Sounds like you got a problem. You're not getting us mixed up in someone else's problems again. You're too soft, you are. Still, Shulk's gotta be Shulk. Yeah, we've heard that a lot. Oh, hello there. I was thinking about making some shoes for my son's birthday. It's just that I haven't got time to get the materials I need. And I need materials from a level 90 monster. It makes no goddamn sense. It'd be great to help if you someone could collect them for me. This not, better not be a... Okay. This Rex Helm. Azure Flamé Wings. From Opulent Flamé. Uh, I think I remember those guys from back in the beginning. Well, even if I don't remember them correctly, I do know there's some high-level monsters across the lake. Like... Here, right? The, or, I think it's like right here where all the high level monsters are, though there's some high level like spiders. Yeah, alright. What? Um. Okay, this is a new one. You didn't have a quest or anything on you. I mean, I read it. It said Jan was, is infatuated with a 20-year-old uh, soldier girl. He's too old for that girl? Exactly. He should know better about his age. Such an old fool. I think Jan's the guy I just talked to a few minutes ago. That was... You got anything else to say? I want to give that to a piece of my mind. I should probably go back and check with him. We might have a quest. Oh, another quest. Hello, Mortriz. I need to talk to the biggest and strongest one of you lot. And I can see that ain't you. So, Ryan? Okay. For clarification here, let's uh let's just go over it. 1347, 1297. Charlotte does more auto attack damage. Ryan is better than I mean Dumban's better than Ryan too, but if we're going just by like pure numbers here, kid. Ryan's still probably the strongest with sword drive. Whoa, you're huge! I got something I need to ask you. A nickel for every time I heard that. You're lively as usual. What's up with this time? I knew you'd be the one to ask. Oh, always the helpful one you are. Like a big friendly armor. That's the like the. That's like the rhinoceros, like the hippo type thing, right? Hey, come on, kid. Enough of the banter, all right? Ha ha ha. Fine, if you say so. I want you to get me the friendship tokens. Friendship tokens. What are they? What? You never heard of them? Everyone in Kali Nines knows of them. Uh, what was it? Arconio Sickles, Lizard Moon Jewels, and... Mun of Clubs. Now I remember. I collected them when I was little. I knew it. So how about them? Uh, so you, what, so you do know about them. Of course, you collect them and share them with your friends. They say it means you'll be friends forever. It gives you the sense of, uh, what's the word? Camaraderie. I collected them with Shulk. 
So we have them. Let's just give them to him then, right? We can just totally give him our old childhood collectibles. I want us three to be best friends. Alright, not that much gold, but a lot of experience. I knew you were the guy for the job. Carnicicles, Lizard Moons, Jewels, and Bun of Claw Clubs. Shouldn't be a problem for a big guy like you. No sweat. We'll be done before you know it. I doubt that highly. Tepper Cave, Tepper Cave, Tepper Cave. Alright, looks like we're going to be going back to Tepper Cave. I'm assuming that because Ryan was the person they needed to talk to for this, that this is his skill tree branch thingy. Uh, okay, we get done, man. Then we get this. There we go. Anyways, I think that's the last, like, one I could find here during the day. So I'm going to make a round at night, and I will be right back. Ah, oh, I can invite this guy to uh, Colony 6. You get your ass to Colony 6. I need to fill that place out. That guy is getting right up my back lately. He said I should be ashamed of chasing young girls at my age. Do you know how hurt that makes me feel? Could you go into more detail? Shulk, I want to know too. I bet you do, Fiora. Easy, Fiora. We'll get to the bottom of this. Regret. Then remorse. I took a long, hard look at myself, and after he came to, after he came to speak to me, that got me thinking. I don't want the youngsters... I don't want the youngsters today to turn out like me. That's why I've decided to give you whippersnappers a test. You have to pass it so you don't turn into weak adults. Dude, this is... An old ass quest. Alright. Apparently, I missed this back in the day. Maybe not. Hello. I have a fairly sizable problem, which makes you t your timing impeccable. I believe this is a problem best shared with you. I need, the full I, I need to fill a support role. It has similar duties to a lieutenant. I have two candidates line up, Minnie and Dorothy. Minnie is the current frontliner, uh, front runner. She's experienced and dedicated. Dorothy also has her plus points. She is not as diligent, but her younger, but is younger and has potential. I'm completely torn. I don't know who to choose. I suspect that you uh, you have had a lot of experience with people. I would therefore like you to decide on which is more suitable. That doesn't sound good. <laughs> I agree, Shulk. So why shouldn't we... So why shouldn't we... I don't know. <laughs> Shulk fucking threw me off there. I'm at such a loss, Sai. Could all this worry be causing my hair to fall out? Yes. Where was I? Oh, yes. Could you assist, uh, assess each of them for me? So it's like that uh, Master Successor thing earlier. Your help is appreciated. Okay. I know where Minnie is. Oh! Found her! What do you want? I heard from Captain Raul. How about you help me do some good for defense? What? It just so happens that I've got a problem that needs his sorting. Fisher's Ron is showing up under a bridge, the one between residential. Yeah. So the bridge between here and how is this getting to know her? Seriously. <laughs> so we gotta go defeat fish in between the bridge. All right, fair enough. Let's go talk to uh, Dorothy. This one should be relatively easy because she's over here. During the day. Actually, I totally thought uh, Minnie was. Uh, oh, hi. What's it called? At the fortress during the the day or night? And no, she wasn't. That wasn't it. Wait, did you hear that? Oh, forget I said it. I, at once. Speaking of hearing things, Captain Rule told me you'd come. He said you like the you like solving people's problems. Well, I have a serious problem. Shut up, I didn't mean it like that. 
Could you go into more detail? Anyways, don't think it's urgent or anything, but could you find me five heart pieces, uh, peaches? I hear they're yummy. I've never eaten them before. What? What's wrong? I thought you liked solving problems. In Alchemoth. All right. No problem. Leave it to us. Apparently, I don't have any of those, which is kind of surprising. All right. I'm going to go back to uh, looking around this place at nighttime. Oh. Ah, oh, we could totally take them. The enemy's weak, but don't drop your For some reason, I thought these were fish. I don't know why. I want to just aggro all of them and see if uh, we live. I kind of want to do that. Yeah, let's do a buster. Did not hit everyone, huh? Hey, we got a silver chest, though. Alright, everyone. Aggro. No? Fuck you guys. Jesus. They're just, like, not even paying attention. What do I need that for? Oh, Ryan's quest. Oh, that's awesome. Nice. You don't know how happy I was when I saw that I was able to actually view this heart to heart. What's up, Charla? Jiggly physics, that's what. I look at the colony and all I can think of is how things used to be. Back when you lived in Colony 6, you mean? Before all this happened? Yeah. I think, I think about what Colony 6 was back then then and then I remember the state of it now and it breaks my heart do you want to go back there or will it be all it'll be all fine I think Ryan would be more reassuring it'll be all be fine okay you're blowing it Ryan you think that reconstruction is going to be easy it's okay they all know you're out here fighting for them you listen here Ryan if I'm out here fighting, that means I'm not back there helping out. Oh, fuck. We're burning bridges, Ryan. I don't... Okay, Ryan's kind of, like, thick-headed, so he'd probably say so. So? Oh, fuck. What are you talking about? This is important. Is it? Don't get me wrong. It's a bad situation. Get as angry as you want about it. But what good is second-guessing yourself supposed to be, or supposed to do? What do you mean, second-guessing? Let me ask you this. Whose idea was it for you to tag along with me and Shulk? Mine, I guess. So why don't you give yourself a break and concentrate on that? You're just not- there's just not enough time in the day to worry about everything. Yeah, I can see what you mean. I should concentrate on the road ahead. Right now, my goal is making them pay. Wait, what? No. Your goal is stopping anyone from getting hurt, isn't it? Oh, well, yes, I suppose. That was, I was just about to say, that's the first time actually I think Charlotte ever mentioned anything about revenge, right? I don't ever, I don't ever remember her saying something like, oh, I'm going to make them pay. Maybe when Gata was involved, but I can't do it on my own. That's why I need your help, Ryan, to protect my friends back home. You don't even need the ass. We're all on the same team. And I don't want to lose anyone either. So let's show them how it's done. Hee <laughs> hee, I knew you were going to say that. Ryan, you're something special. You know that? Yeah, I just completely fucked that up and you still are somehow gaga for him. Heartbreaking. <laughs> I'm guessing that's the achievement to screw it up royally. Anyways, I was saying I was glad I could do that because the swim over here is like, oh, God. Well, there's one of the things we're looking for. Uh, those guys were the wrong, uh, let me, guys, before. That's kind of a shame. 
don't know why the pink one's not attacking us or anything like that. You, you don't want to help your friend? Cutting him in half. He's, you know, he's dead. Good job. Alright. That's good. We can probably give that to Dunman. And there's one of the wings. Hey, a unique monster. The enemy's weak, but don't drop your guard. I don't have time for small fry. Oh, we aggroed them all, huh? All right, everyone over here. Looking good too, Fiora. Oh, Shulk, you shouldn't be hitting off Fiora in the middle of combat, buddy. No, everyone back over here. We fight. Take care of the small ones first. Guys, you know the routine. Eh, well. There you go. You're only level 68, huh? I kind of feel bad. Yeah, you dropped the gold chest, so I don't feel too bad about it, actually. Okay, this should kill him. That was a lot of damage. Um... Double wind. All right, we get two golden chests out of that. Lovely. Uh, hmm. Okay, so light heal. That's good. I need to make room. I, I meant to sell like all of the guns that I had because I have fewer not fewer uh, Charlotte's best weapon probably but uh, we'll get rid of this 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 and take the rest hey meteor staff drive boost I think that's a Fiora move did I do that I don't think I did that Let's do that now. I actually have a lot of skill books that I should learn. I get drive. Oh, that's a Sharla move. Light here for Shulk. Zero gravity for Fiora. Sharla. Oh, another Fiora one. Good. All right, that should be all the books. All right, we get your overly powered materials for your son's shoes. You jackass. You get a Rex Helm. It's probably heavy with no slots. Hey, what'd I say? Go figure. Anything else that you want to have us do? Now that the business is over, I can take you think of my family. Alright, well, that was easy. Hey, Minnie. So you get rid of them. The residential district should be safe now. Thanks for your help. Well, at least this one actually had us do something that benefits the colony. And not is based on how much she wants to eat it. Uh, as for Dorothy's side of this quest, I think I'm going to hold off until we actually go to Alchemoth to finish it. Because there's full of, like, level 90 Telethia, I think. Uh, what's left? We got this. That is so not worth doing right now. It's not even funny. And it might lead into a different quest, though. I say we go to... Tepra Cave. And, uh... We could... Google Horns. Those are, um... Are those the monkey guys? Let's go, uh... We could go to Tepra Cave, but I... Let's go check out the big, the the monkey with the big name here. Because if I gotta beat that guy, I think I might be able to actually. Where are you? Are you during the day only? I think you might be during the day only. Or he could just be up the. Like giant Gogol or something. Where is he? The 
Oh, there you are. You're not the one I'm looking for, but... <laughs> oh, my friend. You're only one level higher than me, so let's try it. Good luck, Territorial Rotbart. Oh, so good. Let's put armor on, just in case. Um, so, Dunban, my friend. Yeah, there you go. Also, I, uh, totally upgraded Eater and Purge off-screen. That's kind of why I'm using it, because it actually does a decent amount of damage now. Almost ready for a, uh, chain attack. It's Fiora tanking? Fiora, you're not meant to be the tank. Alright. Do this, and then this. Alright. I remember back in the day when you scared the crap out of me. Eh, I thought you were more behind. All looks the same to me. So his next powerful move is the Buster. It does like 7,000 times 3, or times 4. Good lord! I like everything about this chain attack right now. You are dead. All right, a lot of experience. Bonus staff, eclipse gauntlets, and. More heavy gear that... Hey! No, this guy did have! Oh. I need three of them, though. Where the hell am I gonna find... Um... Aren't there a bunch of those in, like, Machina... Forest? Yeah, I thought... Oh, there's another one here, but I think that one's level 90. Oh, let's just double check. Yeah, he's level 90. We'll, we'll come back to this one in, like, eight levels, I think. It sounds good to me. Now, not Mac in the Forest, uh, Chateau Marsh. Actually, I think there might be some Mac in the Forest, too. I don't know. Uh, they are, like, here. So, yeah, we'll go up, we'll kill a few of them. There might be even a unique monster up there. Assuming I remember how to get the hell up here. Just go over there, right? Yeah. I'm actually surprised there's not more, like, Telephia around. You know? Because, like, the Bion is, it should be changed. These are just monsters that have all been here throughout the game that I've run away from in fear. Which is totally reasonable. I think after this, we'll run around Tepra Cave a little bit. Because there's still some areas that I need to explore there anyways. Okay, yeah. These are definitely, uh... The guys that I'm looking for. What the hell? That's cool looking. Never noticed that before. Now, if this starts taking, like, a long, long time, I'll probably just cut out until I find the other two. I think I need two more. And then we'll go back to calling nine and make the weapon. He dropped the silver chest. That actually will help immensely. Lancelot gear? I'll give that to Shulk. Hey! That wasn't it. Shit. That guy looks like a, like he's eight levels higher, not eight level, four levels higher than me. Oh, you guys are all four levels higher now. That's bullshit. I need to find weaker ones. Where are the weaker ones? You're weak. We can't lose. 
Uh, we could probably lose. I'm not scared or anything, but that guy probably is an asshole. Hey, that should be the last one. 81, 85. I think that might be a little bit too high for us. We'll come back when we're like 83 or something. Let's head back to Colony 9. Because I think that's probably the last one. No, there's the token of friendships ones. The other token of friendship ones, the one in Tepper Cave. We'll, we'll do that. Yeah, we'll, we'll do that. I hope the weapon's good for... I hope this weapon has three freaking slots for Ryan. Great, that's all the materials. I better get started. I've done it! It's the best weapon I've ever made. I hope Ryan likes it. Token of French is, uh, Vingurge de... Vingear Driver. Isn't that the... The mustache guy? Hey, three slots! Oh yeah! Hopefully it's not worse than the one he has. Oh, he has Mechner Driver 3, so I'm hoping it's better than that. Not by much. What am I losing with this? Double and aggro up. Uh, better min damage. So that's probably better aggro over time. What does it look like? View character. God damn it. Eh, it's not that bad. It looks kind of cool. Alright. Let's head to Tepper Cave. Oh, I'm still like way too... I'm like way too weak to fight these guys. Yeah! God damn it. Alright, we'll... We'll run. Okay, we'll run away. So we can't do that quest for a little... Yeah, we can't do these quests right now. It's way too much. So I guess the next place would be Colony 6, but I don't want to do Colony 6 just yet. I want to, uh, I want to pretty much recruit as many people as I can into, uh, Colony 6. And then I'll go through the, like, the quests and see, you know, what they have to offer me. Which I hope is, uh, pretty good. Kind of stinks about, uh, not being able to get Ryan's fifth and final, uh, skill tree. But maybe we can end it off with a heart-to-heart. -heart. Dunman Milia. That might be doable. I stress might, because I don't think it is. That is nowhere near doable. Alright. Good, good, good job, Dunman. She hates you. I hope you are well aware of that. It was... Uh, I have the notes that pitch in with me. I should... Because there was a bunch of quests here that I should go over. Actually, I think I have a few quests here. But yeah, I think I'm going to call it an episode here. Uh, thank you for joining me. If you liked the episode, press the like button below. If you're not subscribed yet, why don't you head over to my video section and check out some of my past content and see if it's to your liking. Either way, or again, thank you for joining me. And I hope to see you all next time. Have a great day.